Hello, welcome back to another episode of uh, Panados Reviews. Got my uh, got my knucklehead here with me. Panda. Mm-hmm. Call her whatever you want. No, that's not true. <laughs> my name is Travis. Do not subscribe to my channel. Go to Panda Vape. My name's Travis. You're at the right place. Anyways, today we're taking a look at a little bit of e-liquid that was sent by my good friend, Fix It Danner. And... Mm -hmm. uh, we had tried the original kangaroo custard. Good e-liquid, very hard on the coils. Um, would turn your shit black in like a day. It's not for subone tanks. Definitely not. Unless you got lots of money. Unless you're just swimming in the in the coils. Swimming. But. Uh, he went ahead and sent us a bottle of strawberry kangaroo custard, because that's what we like. We like strawberry. At least I do. Lately, I've been liking it, too. She's been on a strawberry kick lately. He eats it. <laughs> Cause because you, that's my jam. Usually, he, I give him all the strawberry things that I get, and he's not getting no more. I've been vaping it. I have nothing else to vape. No one sends me liquid. Welcome to the new <laughs> world of YouTube. Like... No one. <clears throat> I don't have no fans that send me cereal e-liquids. Hint, step hint. Up, step up your game. Anyways. No, I'm joking. Anyways. So today we're here to look at strawberry kangaroo custard. Is it as good as regular kangaroo custard? Is it still hard on your coils? You might be able to tell we vaped the whole bottle. We got barely enough to do this review. So that should tell you something. But we got more to tell you. Want to take a vape? Mm-hmm. We're going to tell you more, tell you our thoughts about it, whether or not we recommend it. Is it panda approved? What, what is the score I give it? S stick around, oh, you're going to find out. I thing now. Okay. So, is it panda approved? Will it get the stamp of approval? What score will I give it? Stick around, you're about to find out. But first, let's go up close and check out the bottle. We're back. All right. We're back. <clears throat> so, uh, we've had this bottle for under a week. Um, we vaped right through it really, really quickly. Yeah. Both really seem to enjoy it. What were your thoughts on it? I loved it. <laughs> it was real. It was on a sweeter end. Definitely. Yeah. And it was really good. It is still hard on your coils. <laughs> I'd say even more. Yeah. Um. But it is so delicious. <laughs> it is so, they're, they're both delicious. And just that strawberry is a, in the sweeter in there, the strawberry. And it's just, it's so good. It's so good. Oh, I wish we had more. Yeah, it's weird because I definitely, it's, it doesn't really taste comes, like kangaroo custard. It comes out a little drier in that, what you're using right now, though. Okay. What I, um... What I used, it came out s sweeter. It's a little dry in this, yeah. It's a single coil in the mesh RDA. It's got a big fat coil um, that of some variety that ADV sent to me when we did a trade. Um, so yeah, it comes off a little bit dry. It's also the coil is in the cotton is really dirty because I vaped it with this juice. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, that, that does it. I mean, literally less than a week, your coils and your cotton are going to be just destroyed. And so, but it's well worth it. The flavor is phenomenal. It's so, so good. And with any sweet um, e-liquid, no matter how premium it is, it's going to destroy your coils. Um, and it's it's a del it's worth it. I just wouldn't do it in a sub own tank because I think you're going to be shorting yourself with flavor and you're going to go through coils like crazy. Yeah, this doesn't have a really sharp, defined, like, real narrow band flavors it's really just more sweet it's got a really dense sweetness to it it um, definitely tastes the strawberry yeah it definitely tastes the strawberry um definitely tastes vanilla mm -hmm. um i don't get a lot of what i would call custard in it no because custard to me is dry it's got mm. a, it's a, custard always comes to me dry and it's more of a vanilla strawberry to me yeah for sure i think vanilla strawberry um a really dense sweetness it's a really simple e-liquid in all reality. 
Um, it had a real nice dark coloration to it, nice amber um, coloration to it. Um, it was really obvious right from looking at it. As soon as we got it, I, I said this is going to be tough on the coils because you could just tell it had it had a good amount of sweetener in it, which is not a bad thing. I mean, Panda loves that shit. She loves a nice and sweet e-liquid. It wasn't like there's some sweet e-liquids that you can't vape nothing else. Like the, when I vaped the one, I couldn't vape anything else. At, like with that unless it was like lemon or like anything tart I can vape but anything else it like muted the flavor of anything else it just overpowered anything I would vape with it this I could still vape other things and I enjoyed other e-liquids even sweet e-liquids and so but it was still nice and sweet i loved it it was so so good oh my god i vaped it so fast so fast yeah it's a trip because you normally i don't really like um super sweet e-liquids this one it, it didn't even though it is very hard on the coils and cotton it doesn't come across tasting very doesn't taste dirty no. and a lot of times really sweet e-liquids taste dirty to me especially after like once it starts getting your cotton dark it starts tasting like oh i gotta change my cotton like it just don't it doesn't taste right it tastes like grimy and like just not the same and you gotta clean your coils and clean your cotton and like do all that to get that good taste again i think i changed my cotton like um once maybe but i'm i vape a lot like i vape a lot and i vape hard so I put a lot of like damage to my coil, my coils, and a lot of heat to my coils. So I always have to change my my cotton. I think sweet I, I think I changed mine once, um, but I had it in two different RDAs, and I changed both of those cottons once. Um, that is unusual for me because most of the e liquids that I vape aren't that hard, and so I can go a couple and he of weeks usually without vapes changing multiple things. Yeah. yeah. I did find myself pretty much only vaping this. Um, I did like it a lot. The strawberry didn't come to me um, in the beginning. I was kind of like thinking like, where the hell's the strawberry? But it's just a really sweet strawberry. And it really kind of blends with just the overall sweetness of the e-liquid. But once you vape it for a while, you really do start to distinguish the different flavors. This brings out the strawberry really good. Mm. But it, it but, the, but you get that dry effect. Um, but it you get... You also get you get like a dry strawberry in mm. this it in this RDA. Um, mine wasn't like that. Mine was more like it was just all sweet goodness and because I wouldn't have liked it if if I was vaping it. And it was like that. Mm. Like I like it, but it wouldn't been something I would have kept vaping because I like that s sweetness on your tongue, cut like that really sweet. Vape. Like this so, soft, wet, not wet, but like soft, moist sweetness. Yeah, you know. and I, I forget what I was using, but I think I was using my um, squonk, right? I was mm -hmm. squonking it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and take in the... Um, US1. Is that the US1? US1 yeah. V2. In the US1, it was very sweet, very delicious. It was yummy, very vanilla, strawberry yumminess. Every vape was delicious. Vanilla, strawberry, yumminess. I couldn't have said it better myself. Mm, it's uh, so good. I think it's, you know, I definitely highly recommend it. Um, it is, again, with a big caveat that if you if you are concerned about coils, concerned about cotton, that's an issue for you, then this is not going to be the, it's not going to be the e-liquid for you at but all. If you, but all. if you do, like, coils and RDAs, then it's, I would definitely recommend it 100%. Uh, the only other thing, too, being it's if you... Panda. Approved. If you don't like sweet e-liquids, you're not going to like this because this really lives and dies like, by the sweetness. You don't really like sweet e-liquids and you mm -hmm. like them. No, I don't But because the strawberry here really kind of cuts through a lot of the sweetness. Um, and just the, the quality of the flavors. Um, just with like the original kangaroo custard, the, the quality of the vanilla, the quality of the custard really saved the, the yeah. e-liquid. It is a strawberry. Yeah. Is a it isn't like a candy strawberry. It is a sweet strawberry. Yep. But like you were using this, so maybe that's probably why you, you vaped it a lot longer because it comes does come across very different in this REA than the US one. 
Oh. Well, you were vaping it out of your squonk, but also you, then you were vaping it out of the Kylan RTA that you had. And then you switched over to whatever. No, I yeah, just yeah, no. That you did for oh, sure. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. And it, even in, RT, in RTA, it was, that has an amazing flavor, period. The Kylan RTA is amazing. Um, yeah. and, but it still was sweet. It wasn't like how I'm tasting it out of this. It's, this is maybe it's because it's the one one coil and it's, that's a really beefy coil, but um, yeah, it's for you. I'm surprised you liked it because it how sweet it was. Really sweet. I liked it and I actually liked it in the RTA a lot because it kind of toned it down. It softened it up a little bit, and it was um, it was a little bit it tasted a little, even a little bit more sweet. It really brought out the sweetness in it yeah. more than anything. But there was just something about the way they do the sweetness in this e-liquid. It's not, it's not like a cheap sweetness. No, it doesn't just taste like sweetener. It, doesn't, it, yeah, it tastes it, like a sweet dessert, and it's yeah. delicious, and I can't recommend it enough. I give it a 4.5 out of 5. I think if, it's tremendous. If you don't like... Um, if don't if you don't like sweet sweetness, the, the synthetic sweetness, like the fake sweet flavoring if you don't like sweet e-liquids because of that that's not this at all that's you um i would still i would give this a chance because it is not that kind of sweetness it's more of an like sh just a sweet strawberry very very good um ingredients that makes it a, a higher end sweet sweet e-liquid yeah. rather than like um just like a This sweetener. isn't like your two buck chuck with a bunch of sugar dumping. Oh yeah, it's not like No, it's good. I mean, there's some like good e-liquids that good e-liquids that like even for me liking sweet e-liquids, there's some that are good for like I'll say like maybe a, 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 for a couple um days and then I'll have to constantly change my va my my coils and my cotton or my just or my cotton because it starts getting that it's synthetic nasty taste in your mouth like it's just not it's not a, like a premium sweetness in the vape like it's just like a premium sweetness in the vape like it's just nasty and you lose that um the sweetness i i was vaping when i first started vaping the e-liquid this doesn't have that it's just it's a really 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 good sweet e-liquid and I, I recommend it if you like strawberries and you just don't like that cheap, that like trashy sweet e-liquid. This isn't like that at all, at all. I think you would like it. Yeah, I can't recommend it enough if you're into strawberry milk and because that's kind of what this comes across as. It doesn't really come across like strawberry custard so much. It's just like a sweet vanilla strawberry milk because um, it's very milky. It's very creamy. Yeah. Um, yeah, check it out. Give it a shot. Um, let us know what you think in the comments below. If you've had it before, let us know. And if you're planning on picking it up, let us know that because uh, I'm really curious to see what everyone else's opinion well, on this is. We can definitely use another bottle. <laughs> yeah, if anybody else wants to uh, throw some bottles our way, let us know. Yeah, because, <laughs> wow. Because this, that... this was a big treat for us. Yes. It was nice. And we appreciate our own bottles. Say, come on, I'm kidding. It's never no, we, enough for walking the right world. We have... I, we appreciate it so much. Yeah, I I feel very honored to even try it. Be, tried that because I did, didn't know anything about it, and it, it was delicious. It was be def. It will be something that I would want to put on my to buy list, most definitely. Absolutely. Now that's for that's for sale, right? Yeah. This is a commercial product. That this might was be... just sent by a friend of the channel. His name's Fix It Danner on YouTube. And he's a good guy, and um, he always takes care of uh, overdose vapes. So that might be something. Remember when we were talking about we we're buying some e liquids. I mm -hmm. might actually, that might be if it's not too expensive. That might be what I, I think want it's to buy. Reasonably well priced. So because it was really, really it good. Really, I really miss good. it. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, yeah, four point five on my scale. Panda, Panda approved. approved. She's got a sticker. You guys saw it. Until next time, keep your coils tight. Thank you so much to Fix It Danner for sending this out. And Thank you so much. Much love. See you guys next time. Bye.